Okay, we've got a circuit here. I'm going to let Angus give you a little tour as he spins around there. Gives you some different angles. Whoa, this one's coming off. Let me tape that back on there. Sorry. Okay, so notice right here, I'll try to tell you, explain the circuit as well. This black wire comes out of here and goes to the negative terminal of a battery. Right here, you've got a 21.8 ohm. Comes in here to row 25. You can see there's three different legs here. One of them is the 21.8 coming in. Another is this 97.6 going out. Okay, this yellow resistor here comes to line 20. From line 20, it goes right here to this blue resistor. Sorry for that tape falling off there. And then it comes, the other leg of that comes right here into this DMM. Notice the dial setting, notice the reading, ignore the minus sign from this DMM. Right to here, into line 15. From line 15, there's the other leg of the old 97.6. And then it sounds like a steak from a John Candy movie, isn't it? Or old 96er. <laughs> That's, this is staying in. Comes in, oh, so anyways, out of 15, let's make sure we focus on what we need to do here. Out of the 15, and then into here, this 200 milliamp dial setting, and then um, notice the setting there. Notice the reading, ignore the minus sign. From here, it goes out to the um, positive terminal of the battery. I'm also going to give you one more measurement here. So notice this DMM dial setting. I'm going to touch these two leads across the yellow resistor and then you can get the number somewhere right around I don't know, let's say 185 pretty close it's been fluctuating a little bit there but yeah let's call that good